this. In the same vein, some armed thugs numbering about seven on Wednesday allegedly attacked NSAS protesters in Lagos with machetes and other dangerous weapons. Though some of the NSAS protesters sustained several degrees of injuries, three of the alleged sponsored thugs were caught and handed over to the police. Some of the protesters allegedly told Galaxy Television News off-camera that government and the police sponsored thugs to attack them. Speaking on the attack by the suspected thugs, Comrade Kunle Wiseman Ajayi narrated the incident and how thugs were caught. Sponsor thugs to come and attack our protests. These thugs are about seven in number. We were able to apprehend three of them, but the rest of the four have been able to escape. They came with merchants, they came with axes, they came with cutlass to attack the protests. Fortunately and unfortunately, the same time they are attacking us here in the Lagos, they are also attacking the Abuja barricade. What this means is that the federal government of Nigeria, in conjunction with Governor Babajide Shawolu, are prepared to stop our demands. They are prepared to stop our protest and they are prepared to divide and rule this barricade. We want to be sure and we are very sure and we want to take note and we are taking note that there is a security committee handling this protest. They are hidden. They are not known. But we are going to use them. We are going to use our strength. We are going to use our sagacity, our brevity to make sure that nobody, nobody born of a human being can disrupt this protest. Nobody born of a human being can divide us. Nobody born of a human being can do such other things to make sure that this protest is not continuing. Our demands are clear. End SAS, end police brutality, and end all shenanigans of government. We are going to meet again today for a Congress, and we are going to decide further on what is to be done next. Thank you so much. My name is Kule Wiseman Ajayi.